So outgroup derogation on the most extreme end means that you would commit an act of violence, whether verbal or physical, on somebody who you don't consider in your in-group. And so if you're higher in outgroup derogation, the little piece in your brain that tells you, mm -mm -mm, they don't look like you, they don't sound like you, and the threat wall goes up. And so a very extreme example of outgroup derogation is insurrectionists who storms the Capitol steps on January 6th. They said, you know, what was true about all of them is the majority of folks that stormed the Capitol steps were all coming from counties across the United States where the white population was decreasing and the population of color was increasing. And they were feeling threat to their in-group and people like them and what they knew to be true growing up. For our audience, it ends up being more about colorblindness for them where they say, oh, I'm not on board with Black Lives Matter because all lives matter. 